Hi there, it's Grammar Fun Time. I bet you have heard the hit by Casca, but have you ever tried translating it? I sure have. I had cried and the violet bloomed again. You may ask, why is there had cried, not just cried? The answer is simple. I use the past perfect simple to emphasize that one action had finished before another one began. First, I cried, then I stopped crying, and the violet bloomed. You've heard this dance in Anuka's song too. But this crying in Plakala had probably been going on for a while. We should use continuous for long actions, shouldn't we? Why don't we use the past perfect continuous then? Today we're discussing this and a few more cases of the past perfect simple versus past perfect continuous. These tenses are quite similar, but there are three major differences between them. Rule number one. You already got acquainted with this one. While past perfect simple is focused on the result, the result of past perfect continuous is either unimportant or unknown. Tina Carol had sung a lot of hit songs when she became a participant of The Voice. A lot of hit songs are important. Tina Carol had been singing for 12 years when she became a participant of The Voice. 12 years are important. He was excited. He had been talking to Michael Schur for three hours. He was excited because Schur spent three hours with him. Now, coming back to Casca's song. As the past perfect continuous emphasizes the duration of an activity, not the result, we can't use it. In this case, there is a completed action. The violet bloomed. Rule number two. Another difference between these two tenses is that past perfect simple is more permanent. It describes a usual action while past perfect continuous emphasizes that the action had been happening for some period of time. Compare. Nastya Kamensky had always worked hard. Nastya Kamensky had been working hard all her life. You can also mention its length with for or since. Nadia Dorofeyeva had been teaching singing for a few years before she joined Vreme i Steklo. Rule number three. Sometimes it's impossible to use past perfect continuous. First of all, avoid it when talking about actions completed at a single point in time, like start and stop. Had Piano Boy started on time? Not had Piano Boy been starting on time? Secondly, just like with any other continuous tense, past perfect continuous can't be used with state verbs. Jerry Hale had wanted to become famous for a while. Not Jerry Hale had been wanting to become famous for a while. Do you remember any other state verbs? They describe something that you can't see because it's happening inside a person. They include verbs of mental activity, know, understand, believe, and verbs of preference, love, hate, like, etc. Now you try. Choose the best form here. We'd known or we'd been knowing for a long time that the festival was going to fail. Jamala had written or had been writing her new song the night before and she was exhausted. In the first example, we should say had known, as the verb know can't be used in a continuous form. In the second one, we explain the result, was exhausted, using the past perfect continuous, had been writing. What had you been doing when you felt exhausted? I hope it wasn't studying English with our videos. That's all for now. Bye-bye.